Okay, so we're going to draw a histogram now. Um, a histogram, some people say it's like a bar chart, um, but what a histogram looks like is it's got bars of different widths, so you get some bars that are skinnier than other bars. Um, the thing with, with a histogram, the frequency, so how many people, the frequency is proportional to the area. So the frequency, in this case, we can just say the frequency equals the area. So the frequency, um, how many people there are, is the area of the bar, not the height of the bar. So this is the area. And then the height is called frequency density. Um, frequency density. So that's frequency divided by class width. Class width. Um, so frequency density is frequency divided by class width. Um, we need to be able to work out the frequency density. So the width for the bar. So this is 0 to 20. So the width is 20. 20 to 25 has got a width of 5. So it's how far in between the two points. So the width is how wide it is. So 0 to 20 is 20 wide. Um, so the area is 10. So this is the height. This one, frequency density. So we're going to do frequency divide by width. 10 divided by 20. That's 0 0.5. So the height is going to be 0 0.5. So a height 0 0.5, a width of 20, creates an area of 10, a frequency of 10. So frequency divided by width, 20 divided by 5, 4, 15 divided by 5, 3, 32 divided by 10, 3.2, 10 divided by 10, 1, 8 divided by 20, uh, that's 0 0.4. So we're going to have to draw a scale up the side for our frequency density. We'll just go 1, 2, 3, 4 to make it simple. Um, so the first bar, frequency density, that's the height, that's up here. Width, the first one 0 to 20. So it goes from 0 to 20 and it goes up 0 0.5. So that's 1, so 0 0.5 halfway there again use a ruler um, my free hand isn't that good um, so you always use a ruler for these um, 20 to 25 has a height of 4 so 20 to 25 has a height of 4 so it goes up to there and it's like that so try and complete the bar without going too far over the line Um, 20, 25 to 30 has a height of 3, so 25 to 30 has a height of 3, 30 to 40 has a height of 3.2, um, 40 to 50 has a height of 1, 40 to 50 has a height of 1, and 50 to 70 is a height of 0 0.4. So there we have a histogram. Um, not completely accurately drawn, you should always use a ruler, but um, what we do have is we have the frequency representing the area of the bar and frequency density up the side. So that's what a histogram is. So here's a semi-completed histogram, and we're going to have to complete the rest of it. So we'll add in the column for frequency density, which is the height of the bar. And remember, this one's the area, and the width is how far in between these two values. So we can complete that like that. So, and remember, frequency density is frequency divided by class width. Frequency density, frequency divided by class width. So we should be able to complete this column here with the numbers we've got. So frequency divided by width, 10 divided by 20, 0 0.5. Uh, 7 divided by 5, that's 1.4. And 8 divided by 20, 0 
So we can draw these bars on, um, 0 to 20, 0 0.5. So that goes along there. Um, 25 to 30 is 1.4. So all, all the way to the top. And um, the 50 to 70 is up 0 0.4. So that goes like that. Then we have to complete the other bit. Um, so the frequency is the area of the bar. So this is 5 wide and 1.2 tall. So 5 times 1.2. 5 times 1.2 is 6. So the area is 6. Uh, 10 wide, 0.8 tall, so 10 times 0.8 is 8, and again 10 wide, 0.6 tall, 10 times 0.6 is 6. So there we've completed the table and we've completed the histogram. Okay, so see if you can have a go at this one. Okay, so we're going to have frequency density. Um, let's do the missing values here first. Um, 6 divided by 15. 6 over 15. That's 2 fifths. And that's uh, 0 0.4. 4 divided by... Let's write the widths on there. Just so we've got them. Um, 4 divided by... 5, that's 0 0.8, 4 fifths, and 5 divided by 10, that's a half. So these bars, 15 along, up 0 0.4, like that. Five, 25 to 30, that's this one, up 0 0.8, that's nice and easy, straight line. Um, and 40 to 50 is up 0 0.5. So that one goes like that. And then the missing values here, frequency. Frequency is area, remember? So this is 10 wide, 1.1 tall. 10 times 1.1 is 11. This is 10 wide, 0 0.8 tall. 10 eights, 10 0 0.8 is 8. And 20 times 0 0.4 which would be 8. 10 times 0 0.4 is 4, double it, 8. Um, and that's complete our histogram.